I gotta warm up. I can't let Mocha make me look bad. How about anything? Anything. Let's get back to work. Oh! <laughs> good morning, good morning. You guys have made some changes in here. Yeah, yeah, just a few. It's looking fantastic. So I understand you still have more renovation ideas that you wanna do. Yeah, I mean, I think we've covered most of what we've wanted to cover indoors for sure. We need to kind of migrate to the backyard, I think a little bit. Outside, as you can see, we've got a nice big yard for yeah. our six-year-old crews. We've got this play structure that he's had since he was two, so it gets a little less usage. I know Cruz is a pretty sporty kid. Yeah, everything from like basketball, hockey, just any outdoor sport. Why don't we do something that not only, you know, a six-year-old would like now, but can grow into, yeah. would be maybe like a sports court. Ooh, yeah. Right. Okay. Into that, we'll pour a concrete pad, We'll let that sit, yeah. and then we'll come back a couple days later, and then I have some guys that can come in. We'll do a sports court, basketball net, put a fence up. Yeah. That's for him or for me? It's maybe for both. <laughs> it's pretty exciting. I think, like... you know, you're gonna have to share it with him. <laughs> yeah. Okay, you're into it? Yeah. We're into it. You're buying in? We're buying in. Buying in? Beautiful, Let's all right. Let's make it happen, man. I'm gonna bring Carissa back with me. We can talk about the long-term plan with this place. Yeah. Or... Oh. Okay, let's do it. Thank you, bro. We're going to pay a visit to Jenna and Mocha. I've already been here and I've started the process of building them a sports court in their backyard. But on top of that, they're excited because they've got more ideas for renovations inside. Oh, well, that's awesome. I'll get a plan ready for them. Perfect. There they are. Hey! Mocha, Jenna. Want you to meet Carissa from CIBC? Hi, nice Hello. Thank you. Thank, you. Thank, you. Thank you so much. Beautiful home. Thank, Thank you. So you. I hear you have a lot of plans and goals, so let's sit down and talk about them and bring them to life. Perfect. And I'm gonna figure out how to get a basketball net in place. So we'll, do that. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see you shortly. We've got to trim back some of these branches so they're not in the way of the net. I'm gonna use my Greenworks cordless pole saw for this one, make it quick and easy. Timber! So the basketball project is really exciting. Tell me about uh, the other plans that you have. Have you started to think about, you know, planning for the financing to fund the renovation? So, no. Yeah. <laughs> financially, no. Timeline, yes, two to three Good. years out. But uh, financially, definitely looking to get some advice from you. Absolutely. So uh, just to start off some consideration. Okay. So number one, you want to think about your budget or revisit your budget, especially when you're planning out, you know, a larger amount of funding renovation. You want to look at what's your income that's coming in and the expenses right. going out. What about in terms of borrowing money. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So many Canadians will fund a home renovation with either a home equity line of credit okay. or uh, refinancing their mortgage. The good thing about the home equity line of credit is it's available for when you need it. So let's just say you start the renovations tomorrow. Your first payment, you're taking out 20,000. Okay. Then it's another 15,000. So you're taking it as you need it okay. and you're paying as you need it. Okay. It's interest only payments, but um, at least it gives you that flexibility uh, that the payment is static at interest only. So a home equity line of credit or refinancing your mortgage mm -hmm. would probably be the best option. Yeah, those are some really good options. A lot of great info, a lot to, to think about for Jenna and, and I. And so helpful, thank yeah. you so much. Very, it was a pleasure, very helpful. pleasure, great to meet yeah. you. Thanks, all right. sold me on this basketball court. What can Mocha and Jenna expect out of this product? So this court here is 20 by 30 feet yeah. and it's done with our Snap Sports Revolution flooring. It's a very low maintenance, high durability floor that will last for years to come. I like that it's got a lot of grip to it. So improved traction, it absorbs more weight, more impact. So it's more comfortable on your knees, ankles, hips. The installation was a team effort. Yeah. It goes faster, it's more fun and we get to playing sooner. Oh, it's nice! All right, let's clean up this court. It's 
stacked and racked. Eyes closed, eyes closed. Hello, family. Hello. Hello. Cruz, you ready to open your eyes, buddy? Open your eyes. This is official. With the basketball court, you've got the sports tiles, yeah. Yeah. which basically mimic a hardwood floor of a basketball court. The nets are 10 feet, so the balls just come right back. And for mom and dad, we wanted to do something so you could sit down and hang out. This is incredible. Cruz, I don't know if you know this, but I'm friends with the Raptors. No way. Scotty what? Barnes signed the back what? of the jersey Dude, for you. That Look is incredible. That. Thank you, Scotty yeah. Barnes. Yeah. Now you've got the basketball court. Backyard is done. Done. And it's a huge success. It's a slam dunk. It is a slam dunk. <laughs>